There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. Hey Diva, so this video is going to be super quick, so I hope. So I got me another lace front wig by Ion Wigs. It's a 13 by 6 lace frontal. You see how long that is? It has a deep part because it's a 13 by 6. There is an adjustable strap and a nape at the, uh, adjustable strap and a comb at the nape. Plus there are combs on a temple and I did sew in an elastic band. Or no, I didn't. I don't even remember, but I don't think I did. No, I don't know. Okay, well, anyway, so prior to this, I did pre-pluck the hairline and I bleached it. So I bleached it first and then I pre-plucked the hairline. You really don't need to pre-pluck too much because I didn't, but yeah, it came out really, really nice. I decided to, you know, style it and curl it off camera because I have done a lot of videos um, showcasing how I curl it. But if you guys want to see some more videos of me styling the wigs, then just let me know in the comments below. So it is 180% density and it's 22 inches and it's virgin Brazilian straight 13 by 6 lace front so before I forget because you know I do forget stuff girls make sure that you check the description box because there will be a $8 off coupon code yes this wig looks rather longer than 22 inches and of course I'm still smelling it because I was kind of like confused at what con conditioner I used in it because it smelled so damn good then I realized it was from the Dollar Tree so anyways, other than that, like I said, I did bleach it and I did use the Clairol um, clay bleach that I've been using a lot with Dirty Developer and I left it sit on for like 40 minutes. Then I rinsed it out. I used some of that purple shampoo. You have to use it twice and then I allowed it to air dry and then here it is. So I did put two parts in it because I really wasn't sure what I was going to do until I decided to just style it as I was styling it. But so yeah, two parts. So that way you can either have it on the right or the left or you can do something totally different. So now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to make me some sideburn hairs because I really feel like I need the sideburn hairs. So I'm going to go ahead and take my little rat tail comb. I'm just going to part a little bit, just enough because you don't want too many. And you don't want it too thick as well. And I'm just going to take my clip and clip it up and take my scissors. Normally I don't use scissors, but for this one, I'm just going to use scissors. I'm just going to cut it just like a length that I would like my sideburns and I'm going to be using the got to be glam for 24 hour gel okay and I got this from the Dollar Tree the Dollar Tree yes I'm just going to dab a little bit right there and use one of my trusty but oldie toothbrushes and I'm also going to be using that pump it up hairspray which I absolutely love this is a super hole but let me tell y'all let me tell y'all something first of all I did get the hairspray by got to be which is the glam force one I got that as well from the Dollar Tree and it's a 48 hour hole girl let me tell y'all real quick after this video like I did a video a couple videos after this girl let me tell y'all that glam force by got to be hairspray is bomb as heck had my wig tight for a couple of days like serious so if you don't want to use the pump it up try the glam force hairspray for real and like I was saying, back to what I was doing. I'm just going to repeat those steps on the opposite side as well. And I'm just going to sculpt my sideburn hairs. And then I'm going to make some, you know, little wispy hairs. I don't really call them baby hairs because they're not baby hairs. I just like a little bit of hairs on the side so that way you can camouflage. And I'm going to take that pump it up once again. I'm just going to spray it behind the wispy hairs. Like right there onto the lace just like I did on the opposite side. You don't need a lot of this because this is only going to be for like maybe a day hold. You know, if I wanted it for a little bit longer, I would probably put a little bit more. And I'm just going to do the same in the frontal area as well. And I'm just going to hold down those wispy hairs because I don't want to get any type of hairspray on them because I don't want them hard. I just want them to be, you know, wispy. And I'm just going to take my blow dryer here on cool and I'm going to just blow dry that hairspray. You can let a towel dry if you want to or air dry or wrap a scarf around it if you don't have a blow dryer. Either way, it's all good. Okay. 
and once again do you see those little sideburns and those little wispy hairs the hairline I did pluck it like I said and I just you know first I bleach it because I think like if you bleach it first you'll definitely be able to see which ones you want to pluck because you know you bleach the knots out so it makes it a lot easier and smile for the camera because I'm really happy about that pre-plucked hairline that I hooked up on my own you know what I'm saying you know and I'm gonna go ahead back to the frontal area you know the hairline area and I'm just going to cut those wispies because I didn't really want them too long in the front for the side I did leave them because they did come with baby hairs they call them baby hairs they're really wispy hairs and I'm just going to go ahead and sculpt it now that's the gel on top of that little green top right there I'm just gonna take the rat tail end of my comb with a little tip of gel on it and I'm just gonna place that gel on the roots of the wispy hairs so that way they will flow the way I want them to you know like just basically just use the root to just hold it down and now look at this hair like this hair is actually really really pretty 22 inches 180 percent density hunty 13 by 6 lace frontal so you can do a lot of different things with this because the parting is so deep plus the hair is super affordable you know what I'm saying this is probably like my fourth or fifth video for ion hair and I really do like their wigs like they do have some really nice wigs so I do give them that so ladies if you want to look glam you know what I'm saying income tax season is coming up you know go get you some nice wigs you know what I'm saying hook it up look diva and diva like you know what I mean but for this hairstyle I'm just going to do something fun you know I just decided to put it in a middle kind of like pull back ponytail and kind of like poof it up in the front you know my little girl school hair school girl hair style you know and that's the hairspray that I was raving about like I absolutely love this hairspray okay so I hope you guys enjoyed this video you know what I'm saying I did I love you guys I hope you have a great week and make sure you rate comment subscribe check the description box because all of the info will be down below and i'll see you guys on the other side bye